So let's get to it. Let's catch some fish. So the reason why I got this fishing pole in the first place is because it fits perfectly right in my bag. And here it is. This is the uh, same company I use for hooks and lures. It is by Eagle Claw. I don't know if you guys can see that there. But it's a telescopic rod. Folds out really nice. No issues. Um, everything kind of lines up. You just kind of have to kind of make some little adjustments here and there. But yeah, I uh, we're going to try it out and see how she does. I need to change the line on it and put some bait on there and we'll go ahead and start fishing. So I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, you guys, it got a little dark out as I was trying to get my reel going. So uh, I got my pole all set up. I had to rewind it. I had to reline it. Uh, and the good line that I did buy, there wasn't a whole lot of it. And I already used some on previous rods. <laughs> so I had to go back and grab some other stuff. And all I had was like the crappy like 25 pound line. But I am uh, I'm going to use that lure that you guys seen. I don't know if you guys saw my, uh, uh, my live stream I did at Walmart. I got one of those cheap frog lures so we're gonna go ahead and try this out and hopefully we can catch something all right because i've been wanting to get out and fish i didn't get to do a whole lot of fishing last year either so uh new camera i'm using like i said sorry about the audio in the last video i just threw my mic on there and thought everything would be good to go well i had to go in and change everything because this has like a surround sound system built into it into the mic recording so uh and right now i'm using a night the night shot mode on it which is really cool night shot in 4k that's pretty awesome to me Plus it's been raining all day too. That's like, it's even makes things a lot worse, but looks like this rod's starting to get there now. This, this new line. There's like a, there's like a chick off in the distance, like singing her heart out. I was almost thinking about start singing back to her. But yeah, big change of plans. Um, maybe might go canoeing tomorrow. I'm not sure as bad as the weather is and stuff. Um, I don't think that's going to happen, so always good to have a plan A, plan B out. Alright, so I don't, I'm not having much luck right now. Uh, I'm sure everything that would be going after frogs would be on the bottom by now. It's pretty late at night. I don't know. I'm just not really a lure guy. I'm going to keep trying all weekend. Hopefully I can do it. I haven't caught any fish, but I did catch a front row spot to a concert. All right, you guys, so I'm parked out here by the lake. I just kind of want to show you guys my sleeping situation. Um, over on the driver's side, I got my sleeping bag here with the passenger seat down and my uh, outdoor vitals pillow, Ashley Love. Uh, let me see if I can get the other main light on. There we go. And uh, so yeah, there we go. And then right over here, we have my little gas burner stove, which is awesome for doing kind of like stealth camping like this. That's kind of why I got the whole, I mean, it is pretty dark. Like if I shut off the uh, night shot mode, you guys probably wouldn't be able to see anything. Um, I got my little seasoning right here. The really cool thing I haven't got to show you guys is this right here. It is a old uh, U.S. Mint Denver uh, canvas money bag that I'm using as my food bag. Uh, since it's a nice canvas and in here I got lots of goodies I do have a uh, a sirloin steak for tonight so that's gonna be good there we go that's when I cook up with some uh, seasonings on it and for the morning this right here is pancakes uh, I made uh, pancakes in a bottle and I'll have that in the morning along with some 
uh, some eggs, some scrambled eggs, and I got bacon too, some butter, and a few other odds and ends, and then I got my percolators so I can have some coffee in the morning too, so I'm super stoked, super pumped about that, I cannot wait, uh, so let's go ahead and get dinner going. There we go. Now we got fire going. All right, so the steak is just a little bit overdone. I know you're not gonna be able to tell on uh, on the night shot vision here. Let me see. Let me go back up. Here we go. I'm gonna have. I don't have. I don't know where my headlamp is. All right, so I guess I don't even need it. I'm gonna turn the light off. You can still see me pretty well. But uh, you know what? It's all right. Steak is steak, right? It's not quite as pink in the middle as I like it. I like mine pretty like almost raw in the middle. We still got a little bit of pink in here. When I get done eating this steak, I'm probably going to hit back on the lake. I don't know, since I turned my mic settings all the way down, I don't know if you're going to be able to hear it. Um, right, so we got, we got a, uh, a young woman over here just singing her heart out. It's kind of funny. But uh, steak is really good. And then uh, I'm going to see if I can kind of show you guys let me get my flashlight out here real quick so from my Jeep over to right over here is a wooden fence pole I could actually put my hammock up and sleep in my hammock tonight if I wanted to pull right here my Jeep's right here I can set my hammock up if I wanted to uh, and then put a tarp over in case it rains because I have a feeling it's just gonna keep raining all week but um, yeah I don't know I don't know if I'll do that or if I'll just sleep in the Jeep but man, this steak is really good. I usually do a lot with steak, but sometimes I forget, like just salt and pepper, nice light seasoning on the steak. That's really all you need, you know? Steak is just so good in general. I just like the, I don't eat my steak with like a, like A1 or ketchup or anything like that. I just eat it plain. So you guys tell me down in the comments below, how do you guys eat your steak? And what, how do you like your guys' steak cooked? good mm. this is a lot different than what I usually do just trying up new things you know it's like how many times can someone go out and build a shelter or go out and you know build a, a bushcraft camp I don't want to keep being that guy who just keeps doing stuff over and over again I want to keep bringing you guys new content so hopefully it keeps bringing on new people that's my plan Have you guys went over and left comments on I Am Jake? I freaking love that guy's videos. He, if you guys watch it on this playlist called My Story, it has all of his videos from the very beginning where he actually is not even doing YouTube at the time. And that sounds weird watching a YouTube video of him not doing YouTube. But for like the first five episodes, he's just like, he drops out of college. He's just like, you know, this is not for me. I just want to travel. I want to do a 50 state trip. He's driving his Jeep. He's got like a old TJ Jeep that he converted into like a CJ7. Um, and for someone at the time who had like 10 subscribers and he even said that those were like his friends and families, his video editing was just like through the roof. So if you guys like, obviously I'm so far behind on videos and, and trying to keep videos up for you guys, uh, which I'm working on. I'm trying to record a lot of videos and start posting every day so you guys have a, a new video every day instead of one video a week. Sometimes one or two video, you know, one to one video for every two weeks. So, definitely go over and check out his channel. His channel is I Am Jake. He's a really cool guy. Um, he just kind of quit doing YouTube, and I don't know what's going on. So, hopefully, if you know, we all leave him a bunch of comments, he'll come back and all that good stuff. I, he's never met me. 
He probably doesn't even know who I am. But I got a Jeep. I do YouTube. I love watching him, you know? I would binge watch, and I have been. I, I've been re-watching all those videos from the very beginning to now because it's such a good story about him starting and everything else. Like It's just like a truly good good series to watch on YouTube if you guys are bored of the same old same and want to guys mix it up a little bit. Definitely check it out.